WBAL TV 11 weather forecast with Chief Meteorologist Tom Tasselmeyer. Temperatures back to normal levels will trend a little bit below normal over the next couple of days. A far cry from that 95 to 100 degree heat from last week. Much better weather pattern for summer activities shaping up for the next few days. Officially at the airport, these are the readings from BWI Marshall. It was one degree above average today, but again, the next few days, I think we're running 81 to 86, lower to mid 80, so a little cooler than normal and not threatening those records anymore. Record again today, 100 degrees in 1955. Temperature right now, 85 in Hagerstown, 84 Stewartstown, Elkton, Chestertown, Easton, all in the low 80s, so improvements there on the thermometer for sure. Salisbury at 79 degrees this hour. Nothing on the radar around the Baltimore area right now. We've seen a couple sprinkles pop up from time to time, but they have faded away right now. The showers down in Somerset County are a little more persistent. Also some showers dropping south out of Charles County across the Potomac. And this little thunderstorm cell has had some tenacity with it, just dropping south and holding together as it comes through eastern Pennsylvania with its eye on perhaps Cecil County in the next couple of hours. Maybe the eastern part of uh, Harford County will pick up that shower as it drops south out of Pennsylvania. But high pressure to the north will be the main weather feature for us. The Bermuda High has backed off a little bit, moving out to sea, and this front is beginning to wash out. So I think that will provide a little more sunshine the next few days. Our problem is that it, the flow around it will be coming in off the ocean, so that brings moisture in, and it will result in some cloud cover and even some morning fog, but also some afternoon sunshine. Not the weather problems they have down here in the Caribbean. This is the fifth tropical storm of the season, fifth name storm. Earl, and you can see the movement of it is heading uh, almost due west at about 16 miles an hour. Most of uh, the computer models, as you can see, are all clustered around a landfall in Belize, probably on Thursday. Gusts to 65, sustained winds at 50. It does look like it'll track across the uh, interior sections of the uh, Yucatan Peninsula, then maybe get out over the far southern part of the Gulf of Mexico before making landfall again. So some uh, heavy rains anticipated down there, but staying well to our south. Around here, just maybe a, a pop-up shower this evening. Partly cloudy skies Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Our next significant chance for any shower or thunderstorm activity looks like it's going to hold off until Saturday afternoon. 65 to 70 tonight, which is pretty much close to normal. Then highs tomorrow a little bit lower, 81 to 86, and winds out of the east at 5 to 10. Winds on the bay out of the east, 5 to 10 knots and average waves around a foot. So the seven day forecast calls for temperatures more tolerable, more comfortable, partly cloudy skies Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, showers and storms on Saturday, then lots of sunshine to finish the weekend.